three, two, one. In the realm of space exploration, India continues to make remarkable strides. The Indian Space Research Organization, or ISRO, has reached a pivotal milestone in its upcoming lunar expedition, Chandrayaan-3. This mission signifies India's third lunar quest and marks a significant leap forward in its ambitious space exploration endeavors. Chandrayaan-3 is now fully coupled with its launch vehicle, the LVM-3, at the Satish Dhawan Space Center. On the 5th of July, ISRO announced via social media that the assembly carrying Chandrayaan-3 has been successfully united with the LVM-3. Get up, It opens up a new era of lunar exploration. This crucial coupling serves as an essential leap towards the final stages of pre-launch preparation. The precise date of the mission's takeoff is yet to be declared. However, the launch window for Chandrayaan-3 has been confirmed on 14 of July. ISRO's chairman, S. Somana, previously indicated that the organization would opt for the earliest feasible date within this defined window to set the mission in motion. Chan Hoping uh, launch will take place on 14th and uh, successful landing uh, on the moon, that's our hope. Chandrayaan-3 aims to build upon the achievements of its predecessor, Chandrayaan-2, by demonstrating comprehensive capabilities in secure landing and maneuvering on the lunar surface. The mission consists of a uniquely Indian lander module, LM, a propulsion module, PM, and a rover. These elements are engineered to test and advance the new technologies required for future interplanetary missions. The lander module is designed for a gentle landing at a specified lunar location and to release the rover. The rover will then perform on-the-spot chemical analysis of the lunar surface throughout its journey. Both the lander and the rover are equipped with scientific payloads to carry out a series of experiments on the moon. The propulsion module's main role is to shepherd the lander module from the launch vehicle's point of injection to the final 100-kilometer circular lunar orbit before separating from the lander module. Additionally, a scientific payload has been installed within the propulsion module, which will become operative following the separation. Following its anticipated mid-July liftoff, Chandrayaan-3 will undergo orbital raising. Similar to the Chandrayaan-2 mission, the lander and orbiter will circle the moon before making their descent. ISRO's chairman, S. Somanath, has revealed that the lander has been bolstered with additional fuel and upgraded equipment for this mission. Chandrayaan-3 will follow the trajectory of Chandrayaan-2 and is scheduled to descend at the same site. This recent integration of the lunar vehicle with its launch vehicle illustrates ISRO's determination to push forward with its lunar exploration program. It serves as an affirmation of India's increasing capabilities in space research and development, bringing the nation closer to another extraordinary accomplishment in the realm of space exploration. As India prepares for the launch of Chandrayaan-3, the nation's ambitions reach new heights, propelling humanity's quest for knowledge and discovery beyond our home planet. 